Um, hey, I'm Davey from Vanna. I'm Bradley from Amorosa. And uh, you're watching uh, so, so fucking cool. cool. All right, something cool here with Van and the guys from Amarosa. How are you guys doing, man? Good, awesome. man. Hanging there, fantastic. Man. Glad to be able to squeeze you guys both in for. Uh... Yeah, we're starting a super group called uh, Van and Rosa, so we yeah, don't for that. We uh, thought we'd use this as an opportunity to break into the room. Yeah. How's the tour going so far? Awesome. I, I, it's been great. The Northeast is not as hot as the South, which we started, which kind of sucked, but. Must yeah. be nice to have such a great tour. It's shitty for us. <laughs> <laughs> Having to play to all these kids, it's like, uh, they, the they need so much attention. So they just, they just want a half hour every day. Yeah, God, play music for yourself. <laughs> uh, exactly. Entertain us, motherfucker. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. Switch this shit up. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. Can use that tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, you should. Okay, your turn. It's your turn. Put yeah. <laughs> your symbols out. Exactly. We're gonna watch you today. Yeah. Fucking yeah. Impress me. Yeah. Fuck you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Now, it's it's got to be a little different this tour though, man. I mean, you guys got so many older bands that are on here that some of these kids weren't even fucking born when some oh, 41 school. and Good Charlotte shit had oh, yeah. happened. Yeah. You know what I mean? They were, we were all in high school. Yeah. 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 We were all kids with those bands. Yeah. We were large. I think for us, it's kind of cool to be able to be like, oh, cool, I'm on tour with, you know, Lesson Jake and some 41 and yeah. Good Charlotte. It's cool. It's cool that we're like, you know what it's cool for? It's cool for all the kids that we went to high school for. It was like, dude. I just saw a lineup here on Warp with like yeah. insert yeah. old band here. They they tend to love that kind of stuff. So yeah, for it's, sure. It's pretty cool. All the shit you guys grew up with, you know what I mean? We're like fucking. They open for us today, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What do you think about that? I'm glad to see it all coming. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Like working at Walmart, McDonald's? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fuck sure. you guys. Yeah, yeah. we're sure. rockstars. Right yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, it's cool. It's cool to be. Um, on tour with uh, older bands. I am an older human in general. It must be cool to be a rock star. Well, it's pretty cool. I'll let you know one day. It's like, I'll, Thank you. I'll, I'll teach you about this. Thanks, man. It's Thank great teacher. I'm a great teacher. So that's the whole purpose of why you're in here, is to go ahead and school these guys. Well, I'm life coaching them as like a, just a unit, as like a band, and like just walking them through. Right. Step Helping. by step. Yeah. Helping you guys get your shit together. So one day they might. Yeah. 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 It's, it's, a, it's a slow process. Yeah, slow process. Actually, I actually wrote 131 a new record. Wow. So. <laughs> you and Will. <laughs> <laughs> you and Will. Yeah. We just, we just, I wrote it for them. It was really great. I'm really proud of them performing by song. <laughs> We're so thankful yeah. Yeah. to have this uh, guy. Yeah, to have all of the songs that he wrote yeah. end up being B-sides that we won't. It's okay. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, <laughs> both bands do have new records out. Yes. We put them out the same day. Yeah. We're both out here hustling on Warp. Working them every day. Both death metal records. Both yeah, death black metal, metal death metal. Climbing the charts. Probably, yeah, probably beating Chanel. Yeah. Are you guys you waiting to see what you all get first week, right? We're all uh, waiting for around. tomorrow, right? We find yeah, it tomorrow. Yeah. We might get an estimate today. Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah, but I think that I think that for like both of us, these records are super important to us. So yeah. putting them on board tour uh, is definitely really important. And um, you know, it's like we've been playing. We both been playing like new songs off of it. Yeah. And I watch you guys play, and kids know those new songs. Probably even more than some of the old. It's stuff. crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's crazy. and same thing happened with our band. I go out and play, and kids would come come up to me and be like, "Hey, are you playing?" And I wait for like some yeah, old yeah, yeah. Like, throwback, and they'd be like, "Are you playing?" And they name a new song for the record. I'm like, "We're not, but thank you. I'm like, we'll play on a future tour." So yeah, yeah. Cool I haven't seen I haven't seen you play. I'm sure it's probably yeah, it's probably. Yeah, cool. I'm, I'm sure you guys play. He's well, I give him homework to practice. He's too busy practicing. <laughs> right, so he's super busy. In the right, he's just too right busy. Now. I actually only let him walk around. Too much. So. Yeah, I get tired. Fast. Gotta, really he, has to, he, has to, he has to go back soon, so if we can wrap this up, he's got to go yeah. back. And, uh, I got a nap. Yeah, he's got to your show, and then you got to get locked yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I walk him up with a padlock, and I. With his record playing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, you know, this is what you want to achieve, too. You will learn every word. All the B-sides, all 131. Start learning them. Yeah. Put him in the gym costume. Yeah, absolutely. Off the gym. Feed him, feed him, do the like, cater to little holes in his cage. Yeah. It's always we, hungry. It's got dark guys. Yeah, really. I don't think we've actually answered answer the question yet, though. <laughs> no. <laughs> and, but anyway, Warp Tour is good. No. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. <laughs> so, for, for both of you guys putting out new albums at the same time and having the fans interact with you, I mean, it's, it's got to be a good experience because there's so many different kids that are out there, you know what I mean? Totally. Yeah, so, for, I think we can both relate. It's like you will see an immense amount of, like, Positivity online, and then you'll you, you know you may see some negativity, but it's like 
it's hard to, it, it's easy to get your hopes up and see like, oh, everyone is so pumped about this record. And then numbers start to come in and you're like, man, I thought we would sell 200,000 records. Right. And then it's like, so it's, it's hard to gauge because, you know, with streaming and everything. So, so you can't gauge your you own sales. You no, just, it's hard you because you, you figure, you figure like all the followers you have in your social medias, everyone's like, I love it, I love it. She's like, okay, let me add up all these numbers. Yeah, there's a lot of cool. Yeah. We sold a million records. Yeah. And in actuality, kids, a lot of kids are like, oh, it's great. I sh I've been streaming it or I've been with yeah. like Spotify and Apple Music and all that stuff. It's great. But the, the, pro the only problem right now is that the industry hasn't caught up to the technology, so they right. don't count your, if they would count your streams yeah. as part of your like whole docket for things that go to out to tours, like record sales, they are still responsible for making sure like what your band's technically worth on paper, you know? Yeah, so right. people behind a desk can go like, oh, Emma Rose and Vanna can do this tour because they've sold this many records. Like in actuality, like it's all about the kids, but buying records is super important because we want, if you want us to come tour to your city, and you want us to come around, and you want to sing these songs, you have to go buy that record. And it's not that much. Records are like $9 on iTunes. We're selling ours for $5 here. Yeah, yeah. It's, not, it's not a lot. It's not a lot to ask. I'm yeah. undercutting every band. Like, how much is selling your record for? We're doing it for five, we're doing it for two over here. Yeah, that was us last year. Yeah. 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 So I mean, it's just important to buy the records so that we can, in later in the future, come and chill with you guys. Yeah. Well, you know what it is though, man? Kids don't understand that this is a fucking job for you guys. Sure. You may have the best job in the world, but you guys are rock stars. They don't apply it already. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. But, like, they don't understand that they have to go ahead and support you and buy concert tickets and buy your CDs. I mean, they don't have to. The, the thing shit. that I say, like, people don't dictate whether or not our music is good or bad. That is for us. Like, if we say we just, we both just recorded the greatest records of our career, then we just recorded the greatest records of our career. Right. The fans decide whether or not that record is successful. There is a very thick line in between success and you know, quality. Right, it's right. not for fans to decide whether it's quality, it's for them to decide whether it's successful. And if they do want us to tour, like Davey said, like then they need to be it needs to be yeah. successful. You, you, yeah, you gotta get you gotta get behind it. That's the thing. You gotta tell a friend. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't take that much. I mean think about think about what you're buying. Bands record records every two years just about. Yeah. You're buying two years of our lives spent, you know, pouring everything into this, you know, ten tracks. Like I don't think it I don't personally think it's that much to ask for. To spend a little bit of money to be part of someone's life. I mean, I'm not buying a record. But. I mean, I'm streaming all day. I'm right. not buying I'm fucking not over that shit. Actually, it's yeah, funny. Really one of the first yeah. records I bought this year was their record. I pre-ordered it when it came out. Mm -hmm. And as soon as it, we think about this. As soon as it came out, I pre-ordered it. It was just like, oh, it's available on your phone. Which is funny that I got the alert of all hell and 131's is available That's on your phone. You should have started with ours. I, I tried to. It just opened it up. Uh, and But I, I looked at it and it was in the bus and instantly got anxiety for the both of our bands. Like, yeah. Oh my god, first week. It's started. out! It's yeah, out! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. Yeah. It's a real thing. So after this wraps up, man, do you guys are going to keep on going? I mean, I understand you guys are going to be doing stuff. Separate stuff. Separate, Separate stuff, yeah. We're, uh, we have a tour coming up in. Uh, was that? The fall. Yeah, know. they got a tour in the fall. Yeah. We got stuff coming up too. Yeah. Uh, we're going to the UK in September. Yeah. We're going to be a Banner Rosa tour in spring. Banner Rosa tour. Banner Rosa That would be sick. <laughs> no, yeah, we're, we're going to be on tour. The like, thing is, we put the new record out. Like, we're going to be touring on this pretty heavily, both bands. So, um, you know, try to come out wherever it may be. Um, and I, man, this is the biggest thing I hate. You guys probably agree with this. We. Pay attention when bands are coming on tour. Oh man! Like we, you know, we play Dallas, Texas. Next, two next days later, day we got one. Come to Dallas. Yeah. Right? We're come on. We were just there. Oh, I didn't know. Like there's literally an app called Bands in Town that you it can you choose your favorite bands, bands yeah, yeah. and it'll alert you literally 30 days a week, day of, an hour before you can have alerts, and you can purchase tickets on the app. We used to have to like track down flyers and like put it up yeah. in our head and be like put it on our calendar and like figure it out. It's yeah, so dude. easy nowadays to just go for, see your favorite band play. Just go do it. You want yeah. True. <laughs> True. It's got to be so hard though when you guys are you know playing clubs and different kinds of, of smaller venues because you don't have that advertising potential as someone that's Coldplay or fucking yeah. I mean we don't have the Guns and Roses. Just, yeah. You know what I mean? So like you just played at the waiting room. Yep. Recently. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yes. They fucking put the announcement out. That day before the EK. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So you, you can't really rely on like the local clubs and stuff to like promote. You just gotta get, to get out there and do your stuff. Yeah. That's why like we we will post everything on our socials yeah. way before, like months in advance, like, and it will be nonstop. So all you have to do is just pay attention. A little attention. Just a little bit. Open your eyes a little bit. Like take that phone that you're on constantly 
and look for stuff. The phone that they're out there filming, you guys, with yeah. fucking when you're on stage, the whole yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Just use that phone for something good other than just to, like try to boost your. I'm starting uh, to, starting to get that though, like the recording live performances, because if I was watching a band as good as us performing live, yeah, right. I would want that. I want it all day. Forever. Yeah, I'm cool with kids um, taking out their phones and stuff, because I literally had kids come up to us at the merch table and like, you know, we had this one kid come up that was SARS and that got deployed to the army, and he just watches that like the he, the, the whole show. He just watches the whole entire band show while he's you know out there. Um, so I, I, I the balance of phones at shows are like I'm always like on one side of the fence or the other, but um, not as they use it for good. You know? Do you think that the bands that are out there that go ahead and make the big deal about you having your phone are doing that for more attention than? The actual video. I think it's probably maybe stuck live, or are they just like <laughs> yeah, or they're just bitter that they're not like getting. I, mean, I think it's fifty fifty. I mean, think about it. Corey, you gotta just slap the phone out of that kid's hand three days ago. Yeah, I mean, yeah. like yeah. the thing is, like they are, they came up in, a, in an era. Yeah, it's a different. It's time. like yeah, and I totally respect. That was also like, different though. That kid was like texting at yeah, the front barrier a, of like a Slipknot yeah, arena show. He was right? in a if you're gonna go out of your way to be at the front barrier, don't be on Talk your phone texting. Right? Yeah, yeah. You can tell when kids are videoing and when kids are just like. Facebook status thing. Yeah, right. You know, I used to. I've I've had to replace phones. I used to. This is the thing in my band. I did a long for a while, and I just I would just like pour water on phones and kick them out of hands. And I've had to just like start here. Go pay attention to our show next time. Uh, the kids would be like, oh, I was I was tweeting about how good your band was. I was like, do that later. Like, why are you yeah, doing this? Yeah, for sure. Band's still playing. You know. Um, so it's, it's always we, we could suck the next song. Like, yeah, we might. Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't, yeah, don't your, your opinion might change. change. We could be terrible. This song is good, but we might not know how to play our new stuff. So yeah, we could fuck up and and up the yeah, show. Yeah, so. yeah, absolutely. So if people want to follow up. They want to know more about both of you guys. What, what are they going to do? So if you want to check out Vanna, just follow at Amorosa. <laughs> yeah. Instagram at Amorosa. Yeah. Uh, all that kind. Of, if you want to follow Amorosa at Amorosa. <laughs> Instagram. <laughs> Instagram. Are you guys Vanna everywhere? Vanna uh, Band. We changed that. Vanna oh, Band. Vanna Band everywhere. If you want to follow us, um, if you type Vanna into V A N N A. Do you guys have Snapchat? Yeah, we have Snapchat. It's Vanna Band. Van it's Vanna the Band. Vanna the Band. Uh, you gotta be good. You gotta get that shit changed. We try. We're working on it. This Snapchat. Snapchat it takes a while. It takes a while. Yeah, yeah, thirty days, right? Thirty days. But uh, yeah, we have we have all the social media stuff. If you if you search uh, Vanna on. Uh, Instagram and the hashtags, mostly pictures of bathtubs will come up because uh, Wana in German it means bathtub. Okay. Oh, so very um, just sift yeah. through the sift through the. Um, that should be your album cover. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You all should all come the, out in a fucking bathtub every time you perform. Sift through all the bathtub pictures and all the uh, like uh, Spanish girls named Vanna that are like quinceañeras. Flip through all that, you'll find you'll find us in there. Oh, I'm there. making the Vanna Rosa Twitter right after this. Yeah, you can follow that out. Too. Yeah, we probably won't want to follow it because we're going to be garbage. But it, mostly nudes. Yeah, mostly yeah. yeah. Nudes and bathtubs. Yeah, yeah nude bathtubs. In bathtubs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So okay. you, can, you can find us everywhere. Just it's not that hard. I love that I brought my phone up and it's this the Bajan Poo. Just a little it's tiny cute dog. Like, like right? So cute. Yeah. Let's <laughs> see. Vanna. Oh man. All right. What was the band? And then yeah. below, let's see. Hit images. Guys, you guys are just in the weeds. No, 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 no. No, no you, you, you can go on Instagram. It's because oh, yeah. on Instagram, yeah. Google understands you're in America. But I'm not really quite sure why people are hashtagging like. That, like, what's so interesting? Come on, check out my bathroom. Yeah, seriously. Vama. Like, you I mean, it's gonna be covered with warp tour stuff right now. That's true. Warped warped, but like, man, I can't find one potty on this whole thing. You gotta go back to the one. It's gotta be for a while. While, while, we, while, we, while we were on yeah. tour for a while, it was just pages of bathtubs, and I was like, come on, man. I'm into it. I'm into the bathtub. All right. Oh, we have to go sign now. Yes. Perfect. All right, guys. Thanks, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.